one of the cores of my performance, or the way I interact with the orchestra, is through this device that Owen and I built. It's called the Arduino. And basically, it's a reconfigurable tool uh, that I use in a number of ways. So uh, one way I use it is I have each column represent uh, or trigger for a different drum, and each uh, button on that column can do different pattern. So you can see if I push this, it will trigger a certain pattern on one of the clickers, or the bell, or the drum there. And so then I can very quickly start reconfiguring and putting together different kinds of rhythms. That kind of thing. Um, but then, you know, in a minute, uh, you know, when we go to another piece, I can just change my software over and then I can be doing something completely different. So for another piece, I'll be using this in a, in a very different way than when I'm controlling the robots with it. Or, you know, for another piece, I have different pitches mapped out to it and I can trigger kind of a synth and... So very quickly I can start to do different things with this device. And so in the performance I'll be doing all that, doing some live drumming, uh, also playing bass, that kind of thing. So my focus is just on primarily the drums and rhythmic material. Uh, so I'm sending information to the robots usually to provide rhythm from the robots. And then also I have a bunch of software set up so that uh, I can perform on the Arduino and improvise with the drums. Uh, which sounds something along the lines of And then at the same time, so I'll be doing that and kind of playing off of everybody else as they're playing. So. In the machine orchestra, I'm going to be playing uh, some of the keyboard components, some some bass and kind of some piano type stuff, some organ type thing. All of the all of the sounds are synthesized on my computer, and I'm playing them through this. Also, I built this thing that I call the Helio. It's um, a series of touch uh, strips that are completely user mappable. So the idea is that I can assign any one of these touch strips to any parameter on any of my sounds. So I can be playing on the bass, for example. Um, and then I can adjust that sound based on uh, some parameter that I defined and mapped to it. Um, and then I can also manipulate other sounds, so I'll be um, interacting with some voice samples, for example. So I've got like... So yeah, th that's the, the Helio, and that's kind of how I'm interacting with the robots and the various sounds during the machine orchestra. So this is the Dilruba, the traditional Indian instrument, and on the bow there's an accelerometer that's controlling a, a max patch. Uh, max is a computer program for interactive musical performance. And it's also, it's also through this, you can control the notes will interact with me and the wave and the plane. Forms of interaction in, in the solo pieces that 
Ajay and I will play, the machines are listening to us and deciding for themselves, sort of improvising along with us in different ways. Um, this is the Dilruba interface. My sitar has a number of sensors on them in a very similar design to what Ajay has. He can show you his sitar instrument. This is very similar, so you can see Curtis and I both have these custom-built um, sitars, all with actually computers on them. So you can see Curtis has you know, all his wires down there connecting it to his machine in a number of different ways, audio and all these sensors um, placed along it. Um, mine's the same, similar, similar situation, so we have sensors like here giving thumb pressure, um, there's, we both have accelerometers in it, so you can get X, Y, Z of how we're holding the instrument. Um, then, you know, I have a series of buttons and knobs on here. You can see my sitar has a USB cable, which is completely insane, so to talk to our, the machine. And the idea is I can sit here, and my computer's all the way over there, and I can talk to it. So you can see I'm, I'm running Ableton and being able to control different sounds. <laughs> And then similarly, I have these knobs which kind of help me move to different compositions. So this composition lets me talk to the robots. play whenever I'm playing. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs>